Did you know that all of the internet that is stored in the servers right now is around 200 zettabytes? That's cool if you don't know what a zettabyte is. That is 200 million petabytes. Okay, let's say you want to download all of the internet and store it yourself. And you made a really crazy virus that is going to get you access to all of the servers all around the world. That's great. Where are you going to store it, by the way? You are going to make a storage server. We have new 30 terabytes of server grade hard drives now. Let's use them. Since we are going to need a lot of space, let's use this one that has 60 hard drive slots. After putting all of the drives, we now have 1,800 terabytes of storage, which is 1.8 petabytes. Even if you put all of the movies you ever watched in Blu-ray into this server, you can't fill it. This makes 36,000 Blu-ray movies. Even if you don't sleep, this makes 10 years of non-stop movie watching. In a tall server cabinet, you can fit 10 of these. 10 servers make 18 petabytes. Let's say you're a good planner and you are fitting them perfectly. We still need around 1.8 square meter space per server cabinet. In your average bedroom, you can maybe fit 8 of them, which now makes 144 petabytes. In a typical 100 square meter family house with destroying the walls you would have around 55 cabinets which is around a thousand petabytes now that makes an exabyte. Let's look at one of the most iconic buildings, Empire State Building. Average floor space is around 2,500 square meters. In a single floor, you can fit 1,400 server cabinets, making 25 exabytes of data. The building has 102 floors, that makes around 2,500 exabytes of data, which is now one layer up, 2.5 zettabytes. So to save all of the data humanity has, you need 200 zettabytes of storage space, which makes 80 Empire State Buildings, that's 6.6 .6 billion hard drives. In total, 11.1 .1 trillion dollars would be needed just for the data storage. You need the land, buildings, infrastructure, and the engineers. Cost of maintaining this project would definitely exceed any living person's wealth. And when you think about hard drives having around 10 years of lifespan, you would need many more trillion dollars to keep replacing them. It would last 250 days to completely download all of the internet. That makes 60 billion dollars for just the hard drive electricity cost.